Back already, Yagamishi. How are you feeling after last night? That shockwave from the blast took you down. Oh, yeah. That was something else, I gotta say. <laughs> I bet, tough guy. Kamurocho's finest detective never fails to impress. Tuck, you made it. We've been asking around if anyone's seen Kuana. You don't want to know how that went. No leads, huh? <laughs> Pretty much. Doesn't help that RK is crawling all over the place right now. Soon as they spot Kuana, they're gonna make their move. Kuana gave this to me yesterday. Isn't that Toshiro Ehara? Kuana-san called you out there just to give you this? Yep. He told me to give it to Ahara. What the? Oh man, it looks like it's cracked. Can you take a look at it, Tsukumo? I get the feeling it's no ordinary pendant. Certainly. Not handing it over to Ahara till you know what the deal is? Well, he won't mind, will he? Besides, I damn near got blown up over that thing. Speaking of, Yagamishi, what's the status of Ehara's sexual battery trial? Saori-san's preparing for the appeal. Still no date, but the courts are working as fast as they can. If they accept the case and it goes to trial, they'll find out about Kuwana one way or another. And that'd put Reiko Kusumoto in public security in the shithouse, right? Right. If Kuwana and his murders come to light, anyone connected to Reiko Kusumoto could be suspected as an accomplice. And if that happens, she'd lose any control she had over the pension fund. Interesting. Everyone wants their own brand of justice to come out on top. But enough is enough. If we don't handle this, public security will take out Kuwana. And I can't let him die like that. Then what's your next move? Gonna head to Ahara's trial and back up Sari-san. <sighs> Feels like we've come full circle. I'd argue the opposite, Yagamishi. The circumstances surrounding the trial are completely different this time around. I can't help but consider how grand a task simply seeking the truth could be. Seriously. But exposing the truth is the only way to save some and get justice for others. We can't just stay quiet and watch. <laughs> Sounds like you're seeing the light. Detective work's not so bad, is it? <laughs> Can you guys keep an eye out for Kawana and Ijincho? I need to go over Ahara's case with Sari-san. 10-4. We'll amp up surveillance. We're going too, Sukiyura. Time to get shit done. <laughs> right on. Hmm?
Well, looks like we've got a full house. Shirosaki sensei asked me to come by. She said they needed some business handle while you were out of town. I find it hard to believe she'd put it that way. <laughs> Maybe not. Either way, I don't mind helping. Yagami-san, you're just in time. I think we should conduct another interview with Ahara-san. Okay, but what will we talk about? If we want to claim he's innocent of battery, then we need to prove he's the one who murdered Mikoshiba at the same time. But since the murder footage isn't admissible in court, we need something more substantial. Basically, we need new evidence. And that might mean something no one's seen or found yet. So your plan is to meet with Ahara and just ask him? I know it's a long shot, but yes. I'd like to come help, but someone has to check Higashi-san's work. Excuse me? If I have to be Hoshino-kun's lackey, I'm fucking out. I'd prefer if you address me as Hoshino-sensei. Mouth on this kid! Ihara only seems to open up to you, Yagami-kun. So, if you talk to him again, do you think we'll find out something new this time? I'll see what I can get out of him. Having another chat with him couldn't hurt. Sounds good. Oh, and look after Salary for me, would you? Sure, but Mafuyu, should you even be here? Won't the prosecution think you're double-crossing them? What do you mean? I am just here to get dirt on the defense. Expect Prosecutor Takano to hear all about it. <laughs> Guess we better watch ourselves. I still have some preparations to make. Yagami-san, why don't you go kill some time? I'll call you as soon as I'm ready. It shouldn't take long. Sure thing. I'm going to try and get in touch with Ahara's wife. Even though they're separated, Ahara may have shared details about Mikoshiba's murder with her. Oh, and Higashi-san will be there to help. Sorry for keeping you, Yagami-san. We should head to the detention center. Where are you? In Kamurocho. How about I take a cab and pick you up? If you please. I'll be waiting. Isn't that just the worst? So the murder footage can't be used as evidence. <laughs> I was hoping it'd be played in court for all to see. Yeah, and if it was, it would prove your innocence and overturn your battery conviction no problem. But the prosecution flat out refuses to accept you murdered Mikoshiba. There's no room for error. You could flat out confess and they would refuse to accept it. Excellent. In the end, they'll lock me up for battery. And I'll get away with murder. Yeah, yeah. We know all about what you and Kwana planned. We just don't have the evidence to prove it. <laughs> My condolences. Which reminds me, you said you'd confess to killing Mikoshiba after you got out of prison, right? Then, as icing on the cake, you'd admit the battery charge was false and humiliate the law for letting a murderer walk free. Exactly. The public must know that the law can't be trusted. Personally, I hope the media hops all over it. I bet you do. So when that time comes, you'll need some decisive evidence of the murder so your confession holds water. Maybe you've got something like that in your back pocket already? <laughs> Hmm. 
Because we'd sure look good if we had some new evidence to take into the appeal. That's why you geniuses came all the way out here. I told you I wouldn't admit to the murder in court. I have no intention of just handing it over. Handing it over? So you're saying there is still a piece of evidence we don't know about? <laughs> what is it, Ahara-san? Even if there was, you'll never get your hands on it. Didn't mean to get your hopes up. Maybe it's a piece of Mikoshiba's body. Would you hide something like that? Well, was he missing any body parts? No, nothing indicated as such. Maybe it wasn't a missing body part. Could be as simple as some hair. Even if it was, that would hardly constitute evidence of Mikoshiba's murder. Hair could have come from anywhere or anyone. That's the extent of what you could prove. I suppose that's true. murder weapon. Kanagawa PD said the weapon used to kill Mikoshiba still hadn't been found. Yet it appears in the footage without a doubt as to what it is. A knife. If it wasn't found at the murder scene, it's highly likely the suspect or an accomplice took it with them. Any normal criminal would have just ditched it somewhere. Except you're anything but normal. You got revenge for your son, and you want to publicly humiliate the law for letting you pull it off. Your point? If you were cleared of the battery charges and confessed to Mikoshiba's murder without evidence, no one would buy it. You'd need something convincing. Busting out the weapon no one's found yet would do the trick. That one piece of evidence would flip the whole case on its head. Well, <laughs> look at you go. Then tell me. Where do you surmise I've hidden this weapon? Well, right after killing Mikoshiba and Ijinsho, you would have had to book it to Ikebukuro Station. You had accomplices with you. And if that's the case, there would have been plenty of time to hide the weapon. Yeah, so... That's about as far as I've thought this out. If that's it, then I'm done here. Kawana's vanished, Harasan. Public security found out about him. Public security? Kawana wanted me to tell you he won't make it to the end of your revenge plan. So, I'm the last man standing, am I? Well, he's already helped me plenty. I never expected to see him again anyway. At this point, he won't be able to outrun them. If public security catches him, he'll get much worse than an unfair trial. Burying him will be the least they do. What do you mean? What's going on? You remember last time? If you don't recall, I said you'd grab the tiger by the tail. And your tiger is... public security? Right. And they're out there on the warpath. Everything has to be brought into the light. We need what you did to be exposed. Kawana can't be saved in any other way. I need your help, Aharsan. Then you lose. I'll never admit to killing Hiro Mikoshiba in court. The system can die. It threw Toshiro away. And I won't lift a finger to save it. Kawana-san knew how this could end. We have our convictions. When this started, we knew it could end up costing our lives. You knew going in, huh? And that's all? Is that what you tell yourself so you can sleep at night? Maybe it is. Yagami-san. Do you remember my original request? to look into both the Hara incidents? I asked you to look into the train event 
And then I asked you to look into Hiro Mikoshiba's murder. And now, I'm afraid I have to make one more request of you. Do you still carry your defense attorney's lapel pin? Ehara-san's trial. I'd like you to take the floor with me to defend him. It's going to be eventful. I think we should go as a team. You sure about that? <laughs> you know, my legal counsel isn't cheap. I'll let Genda-sensei know about the invoice. You got it. Count me in. You never know when something like this will happen. Check it out. I always have it on me. I know that. Huh? You do?